Hi, this is Azusa. Today I'm making dorayaki with uncle and custard filling. For the ingredients for the dorayaki pancakes, you need 4 tablespoons of sugar, half cup of flour, 2 teaspoons of baking powder, 2 tablespoons of honey, 2 eggs. Dorayaki is a Japanese confection, sweet pancake sandwiched with anko, which is sweet wrapping paste. Dora means scone, yaki means baked. It's scone shaped pancakes baked on a pan. Do you know Doraemon? It's one of the Japanese anime characters. It's a cat robot. His favorite sweets is dragi. It's an old classic Japanese cartoon, and many people in Japan grew up watching it. Although my parents didn't let me and my brother watch TV that often when I was a kid, I remember I secretly borrowed manga books from my friend and I read Doraemon. Because Doraemon loves dorayaki, he falls in traps with dorayaki every time, and that was the funny part for me. Dorayaki pancakes contain honey, which makes the dough a sweet and a unique moist texture. Mix egg, sugar, and honey, and after it becomes well mixed and it gets whitish color, add flour and baking powder. And I cover the bowl and I let it sit for 20 to 30 minutes. While it's resting, let's make custard cream. Original dorayaki is filled with anko, which is sweet red bean paste. I previously made homemade anko. Check out the video for the recipe. And these days, the custard is another filling for dorayaki a lot of people like, especially for kids. The creamy custard is also a good option to eat with the sweet dorayaki pancakes. Also, to make custard, they are probably the most common ingredients I usually have in my fridge and pantry. So, when I crave something sweet, I make custard cream. You mix the egg, sugar, and flour and add milk little by little. Heat the mixture and it's t o w e l until it gets thick and creamy. Keep stirring and try not to burn the cream. I like adding fruits for custard, and I found that this custard and strawberry combo is perfect for dorayaki. Now, going back to the dorayaki pancakes. From here, it's a little challenging step because the dorayaki pancakes are easy to get burnt since it contains honey and sugar. My tips to you is to put the heated pan on a wet towel each time you add the pancake dough. It helps to drop the temperature of the pan not to burn the pancakes. Also, keep on the low heat and stay watching the pancakes the whole time. And practice will help improve the skills. Trust me, I did burn many pancakes before these. Anko, the red bean paste, was not my favorite when I was a kid, so I didn't really like dorayaki. Every time I visited my grandparents, they gave me dorayaki, but I didn't eat it. When I lived in Tokyo, there was a confectionery store called Usagiya in Ueno. And these days, dorayaki is so popular that you couldn't even buy it at the convenience stores in Japan. But when I had the freshly baked dorayaki at Usagiya, I fell in love with it. And then I changed my mind and I started liking these Japanese sweets. After the pancakes are ready, prepare the custard, sliced strawberries, and anko, the red bean paste. And then let's spread out the filling 
and I put two pancakes together. You will do the same for custard and a n k o If you individually wrap it and leave it for a few hours, the perfect soft and moist dorayaki will be ready. Hope you enjoy the video. Thank you for watching.